Hello students. Good morning. How are you today? Children, today we are going to discuss about the most important star in the universe that is sun. So children, today we are going to learn about the sun above us. Lesson 8 in our EVS textbook. Children, sun. The sun is the star at the center of the solar system. It is a hot ball of gases that gives off great amounts of energy. Life on earth depends on light and heat from sun. The sun is the closest star to earth. It radiates light and heat or solar energy which makes it possible for life to exist on earth. Plants need sunlight to grow. Animals including humans need plants for food and the oxygen they produce. Children, do you know how do we get day and night? Because of the rotation of youth, we have day and night. Now, what is rotation? Yes, the movement of the earth on its own axis is known as rotation. The earth axis is an imaginary line that runs through the poles of the earth. When earth rotates, day changes to night and night changes to day. Earth revolves round on its axis and it takes 24 hours for one rotation. Children, look here. Since sun is still because of earth's revolution. Children, we face sun for 12 hours and we call this day time and we could not see sun for next 12 hours that we call night. So because of the rotation of earth we have day and night. So children once again tell me how we get day and night? Yes, because of the rotation of earth. Now tell me, what is rotation? Yes, the movement of the earth on its own axis is called rotation. Okay, then revolution. What is revolution? Yes, the movement of earth around the sun is called revolution. The earth takes one whole year to go around the sun. Now children, look here. What we can see here? Have you ever seen this? Do you know this? What is this? Yes, this is globe. What is globe? The globe is a small model of the earth. What is? Globe is a small model of the earth. And look here, what we can see here? Yes, very good, rotation. What is rotation? Yes, the movement of the earth on its own axis is known as rotation. Isn't it? Yes, very good. Children, you know, the day begins with sunrise. And the night begins with sunset. Isn't it? Yes. Now tell me, where does the sun rise and sunset? Yes, of course. The sun rises in the east and sets in the west. Can you find out these two directions? 
the east and west children if you stand facing the rising sun your front is directed towards the east then your back is directed towards the west kids you know there are two other directions also the south and the north how can you find them out as you stand facing the rising sun stretch your hands sideways then your right hand points towards the south and your left hand points towards the north okay now can you find out these directions kids just stand looking at the rising sun note the four directions okay so children once again there are four directions east west north south okay children now all of you try to underline the important points in your textbook okay so all of you please take your evs text and take the page number 45 lesson 8 the sun above us bini had a doubt what is that how do we get day and night kids tell me how do we get day and night yes because of the rotation of the earth we get day and night isn't it yes very good now all of you please take your next page look here what is globe yes the globe is a small model of the earth isn't it yes then the day begins with sunrise and night begins with sunset where does the sun rise and set tell me yes very good sun rises in the east and sets in the west isn't it yes then can you find out these two directions the east and the west you may stand facing the rising sun your front is directed towards the east your back is directed towards the west next there are two other directions also the south and the north how can you find them out as you stand facing the rising sun stretch your hands sideways then your right hand points towards the south your left hand points towards the north okay children now i will ask you some questions to you all of you please try to answer to me fill in the blanks first one a globe is a small model of the dash what is yes earth then the sun rises in the east and sets in the dash west very good then a day begins with the sun rise then a night begins with the sun set very good then second one answer the following first question what was bini's doubt tell me what was bini's doubt yes how do we get day and night isn't it yes then second question what is a globe tell me yes the globe is a small model of the earth isn't it then how do we get day and night tell me how do we get day and night yes because of the rotation of the earth we get day and night then last question which are the four directions yes very good east west south and north isn't it yes now look here draw a picture of the setting sun and color it children here you have to draw a picture of sunset as you like okay then what is our today's project work collect 
pictures of the rising sun and the setting sun okay children now we go to wind up our today's class we will meet again on next tvs class okay till that time all of you please stay at home and stay safely now all of you do your work very well and study very well okay then bye bye thank you have a nice day